Hey my gas, so today I'm coming to you guys because I want to talk to you guys about <sighs> safety. Safety in your house as a parent. I can say for myself that this particular topic is something that um, makes me nervous. I don't want to talk about it. I try not to speak about things that are, oh, that gives me um, a nervousness or a worry of protection for me and my family. And so several months ago, um, <laughs> it's got sauce on it and everything. It's just been all over the kitchen. It's dusty. All types of stuff is all in the package. I got this um, and I'm going to share it with you because we should all have one of these in our house, right? We should all have one of these in our house, but um, a lot of times, if you ever thought about the fact that if your child had to use it, if you were not around, and if it was something that occurred that that had to be ignited, right? Is your child going to have enough of um, composure to not panic and do everything it needs to do? Pull in the pen and do, you know, making sure it's, are they going to do everything completely right? That right there as a parent makes me so freaking nervous. So several months ago, I about say about four or five months ago, um, I found a video and in this video was, I can't remember what I was watching, um, some type of a TED talk or something. And I remember that um, this little, this thing popped up and it was like uh, something about fire protection, but when it popped up it was a link and then we had to go look at all this other stuff and I was just like mm -hmm. usually when I see stuff I'm like if it's invented I'm pretty sure you can find it on Amazon Walmart you know I don't do Timu never did Timu so I don't know nothing about Timu I'm not trying to follow the bandwagon of spending unnecessary money um and then they keep they keep contacting me though which is weird so uh yeah wish you never use it but you must but must but must for households. Long shelf life suggests replace around five years. This is called a fiberglass fire blanket. Haven't opened it, so I'm unboxing it so you can see um, what it looks like. And it's supposed to be two of them in here. Got my little nifty razor. <laughs> it's supposed to be two of them in here. Okay, oh, oh, not bad, okay. Now, I only paid, I think, less than 20 bucks. One should be in your car and one should be in your house. Why? Because your car can, I, I never seen it, but I just thought to myself, I've seen cars on the side of the road where on fire and stuff and stuff can happen and overheat. And you can take this, I'm thinking, and throw it over it. I'll look into it. Don't quote me yet. Do your research too as well. Um, and it just it's so simple. It's three feet by three feet. Great uh, supplement to fire extinguisher. It says pull tapes to release. That's it. You pull the tapes to release. This right here gives me so much more confidence in knowing if my baby is cooking or something happened. Even if it's a small one and she just get nervous, small ones turn into big fires. And so if they are confident enough to know, pull these and throw the blanket over it. That's it. You pull this and throw the blanket over it. This blanket smothers the fire and puts the fire out. I wanted to share this because my channels is just about sharing things that help you in your life as a parent do you know the anxiety level going from boom to boom to know that it's something so simple that you could teach your three four five six and up year old how to hey if there's a fire and it's, it's getting big and you even even if it's a little fire, you show them what it looks like, do videos or whatever to show them what a little fire looks like so that they can, hey, if you see this and mommy's not around and daddy's not around, you take this blanket, pull it, what, 10 bucks a piece? It's worth the sanity of knowing that they know better when they see fire, douse it out with this. <laughs> douse it out with this. These are the type of videos I want on my channel because these are the type of videos that help people. I'm not here to influence you to buy something. This I don't have a link for this. Well, I can give you my Amazon link, but trust me, it ain't even worth it. Like, I can tell you to find them, but if you want to make sure you find a great deal, I can give these to you. Um, and anybody that knows, knows Amazon don't pay you nothing. Like, it's pennies on a dollar, literally pennies on the $10. 
um but definitely i won't put it below but if you ask i'll give it to you just to let you know i don't um any links you do see are links of things that i've had around my house and i keep people people keep asking me about them i try to keep those as, as much as i can i can't add any more links there's links of things that i bought years after i did that and that's why you have to ask for it so yeah this is called the fire blanket and it's by can hero canero i don't know if that's the original i don't know it says on the back it says warning this fire blanket is not adequate size for adult wearing like you can't wear it but a kid can't put this around them and stop them from being burned or whatever hold to release the tabs and pull them downward and outward place the blanket over the flames to cut off the air turn off the heat source leave in place until cool clothing on fire if clothing is on fire lay the victim on the ground wrap them in the fire blanket call for medical assistance and provide treatment so you can wrap this around someone that's on fire that's why i say i got two one going to be in my car and one is going to be in my house this right here versus this as an adult yeah i can do it and thank God, and I, I, God forbid that we ever have to use them, but it's better to have it and not need it and need it and not have it. So this right here even gives me anxiety at times. Like, am I going to be able to think straight to, you know, you just never know. But this, I know if there's a fire, it could be in the kitchen. It could be anywhere. You could take this blanket, throw it over. You don't have to worry about it. So I wanted to share that with you. I hope this was very informative for you guys. And I hope that you get you guys some for your house to protect you, your car, your camper, your tiny home, whatever you have. And you have a space that fire is being used or heat or heaters or anything like that. Get you some of these blankets. I'm, I'm going to actually get me a couple more. Um, and these are great gifts for birthdays, for Christmas. I like getting gifts of things that I'm going to use, things that I know are going to be something that sh relieves stress, worry from me because I know I'm going to, I'm going to have to buy it anyway. So if you buy me a gift of something that I know I can use, then that saves me money and then I don't have to buy it and I can buy me something that I like or so treat myself to something. So yeah. Definitely great gifts for a family for Christmas. If you didn't know what to get your uh, new uh, wedded uh, sister, brother, cousin or something for their home, get them some fire blankets. Get them some fire blankets. Great housewarming gift as well. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed that. And that is it. And if you have any questions or comments, leave them below. If you would like me to put the link below, let me know below as well. And I will see you guys later.